happening tonight in Orange County. Deputies are hunting for a killer on the run. They say someone shot a man along Cortland Street in Orlando late last night. Fox 35's Matt Trez alive on that scene. So, Matt, bullet holes all over that building. That's right, and you'd be able to see them, except that the windows that the bullet holes were in are now entirely broken out. You can see the shattered glass all along the bottom of that building there. That glass had been in those frames and just riddled with bullet holes just a little while ago until they uh, really smashed that glass out of there now. This is all from a deadly shooting that deputies say cost a 43-year-old man his life. This was the scene near Lee Road this morning as deputies investigated the shooting death of 43-year-old Vin Chung. A social club next door was meeting when the shots rang out. Richard Thomas was at the gathering and says he heard the gunfire. Bang, 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 bang. Yeah, just like that. He says there were eight or nine shots. So we wanted to try and make sure everybody was safe, so we got down on the floor and tried to uh, protect ourselves. Deputies say the shooting happened just after nine last night. Investigators were sweeping the building and parking lot for clues all morning. They say they found Chung inside the building with multiple gunshot wounds. He was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Investigators say a man dressed in black fired the shots and got away in a car. Thomas says he hopes they catch him. We uh, definitely need to make sure that, that we can have a safe environment here. Orange County deputies are still on the hunt for the shooter. When we get more updates from them, we will pass them along. But in the meantime, they're asking anyone with information about this deadly shooting to please give Crimeline a call. Live in Orange County, near Lee Road, Matt Treza, Fox 35 News. In Osceola County.